Hello Knight here, welcome back to my Averni campaign. We're just playing as the uh, Gallic Confederation, I think we've become actually. Um, we're going to fight this because it's getting quite boring. I keep auto-resolving everything. Um, we may have a chance. There's quite a lot of these troops in Numidian guys. Numidian horsemen, so they're not going to have their horses. They'll have their javelins, but they won't have their um, ability to attack us all that effectively. So I expect we'll lose, but we may be able to take down quite a lot of their troops. It'll be a close run thing either way. I think this is episode 31, I think, of the Averni campaign. Um, it hasn't been the most exciting of... Um, campaigns to be honest. Um, haven't really had any real challenges yet. Playing this on very hard and very hard. Um, let's have a look. Right, okay, this is fleet. So we'll no doubt we'll split in two, so we'll try and land here. We will try and take some of the space. What have we got here? Stay where I put you. Um, that's what I'm here. What have we got? Skirmishers. I'll group these into one group for fire control. And along here. Oh, let's see if we can... Organize yourselves. Yes, organize yourselves. We'll keep the Celtic warriors in reserve, actually. Tribesmen, I think they can throw stuff as well, actually. And we're going to put them along the beach as well. And obviously these two guys will be joining. Let's get short. Where are they going? So if they're all going to land along this beach down here, what are my ships doing? Oh, I thought we got a speech then by the general. It's interesting. Are these ships actually doing anything? Oh, they are. Right, I'm coming ashore. That's good. I don't know how many more spaces there are here. Maybe one, two, maybe two more ships can land here. So we should be able to destroy them. I don't know what the shield screen does, to be honest. Melee defense can't move. That's a good thing if they do that. Levy Freeman up here. And Levy Freeman up here. Actually, I'm going to move both of them over here. Where's he going? Oh, he looks like he's splitting in two, actually. And he's got three guys coming ashore. So we'll move the... Um, we'll group these guys as well. Move these here. Oh, actually, we're going to move to here. That looks like a nice bottleneck there. Just here, because here may be here. Skirmishers. Should we do a quick reload here? All right. Take him off skirmish mode. I don't want to run about. Reload. Don't know why I did that really. I <laughs> don't think they can hit them yet. They might be able to. How far can they fire? Quite. Yeah, I did that prematurely a bit there. What has he got? Spearman, Spearman, Spearman. So my guys firing yet? I 
are these guys doing? Is that sunk? <laughs> Looks like it's actually sunk. Spearmen! I don't think I can attack these guys until they actually come ashore, can they, I think? Down to eighty, seventy five. Okay, I think I'm going to save my, my guys now. Maybe they should let them come ashore actually. So I can't see that we're actually doing a lot of damage to them. We're going to let them come ashore and then we'll kill them. Right, these guys, what are they doing over here? This is always a Numidian guy, the cavalry. They won't have their horses of course because they never worked out how to program them getting onto their horses. So they just come ashore as infantry. All Numidian cavalry. So they're quite dangerous I think with their... Um, word with their... Ready. can't think of the word. Forward. With their... Uh, javelins, that's the word. <laughs> Literally could not think of the word there. Let's move back. And we'll, um, we'll kill these guys when they come out. So in theory we've killed three units already. It's not a bad start. Let's move these guys back over here. Don't want to waste any more ammo than we need to. These guys can finish them off. That's three lots of spearmen we've dealt with. Where are these tries on going? They're just standing there at the moment doing anything at all. Don't know if that's a glitch or not. Maybe it is. I'm not sure, to be honest. Oh well. Um, gives us plenty of time to form up. Something over this side. Are they kind of come ashore? They look as if they are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Again. We need to probably, I think it's probably these guys we need to deal with first. Yes, I think we're going to move over here first. Yeah, we're going to go back and try and defeat those guys first. I, I honestly don't know what these guys are doing. They're just standing there at the moment, as far as I can see. Whether that's a problem or what, but that allows us to try and defeat them piecemeal if we can. Where are they coming? Coming around here in Emidian Cavalry, so we need to... Some spearmen. Skirmishers. Skirmishers. Missile warriors. I should get these guys fairly soon. Levy Freeman! So Levy Freeman take them on. Yeah, they're gone. That's good. So we 
dealing with their spearmen okay. those Celtic tribes and back actually. These guys don't need to be over there, they need to be there. Something over here, are they moving? They're still not moving, okay that's good, that's good news for us. You have our Where are those other guys coming from? Good lord. They're right the way over here, it's really weird. Um, Okay. Warriors. These guys we need to move back. Levy free men. I don't know whether we can ambush these guys. We might be able to ambush them. Warriors ready. Can't really help fall to have my general because that will cause us a problem. Spears ready. Um, Missile still plenty of ammo left actually. They're still just kind of sitting there at the moment. So we might be able to defeat these guys piecemeal. Ah, they're coming, they're all coming down this this row actually, aren't they? So we need to get these guys formed up. We need to rush in as quickly as possible. get those slingers if we can. Oh, we're going to suffer a bit here I think. Holding them up, so that's good. As you say. Warriors. Need to get in here because they're just going to murder us unless we actually move in. No. Spearmen ready for battle. Kills. Get running. Yeah. Kills. Fire. Skirmishers. No. Need to get in there as quickly as possible. Warriors. Let's frenzy up. Because if we don't get in there quickly, they're just going to kill us off. Need to close on these guys. After them. So we've got some reserves here. before they can fire on us again because they're, they're killing us actually. Good lads, well done. Get stuck in now. Where's my slingers? Right, they don't seem to be moving at all, these guys. I'm really puzzled. Whoop, we 
need to get in there. 34 of them left. We need to charge as quickly as possible. We're very tired actually, to be honest. 19 of them left. Where'd these guys come from? It's getting a bit tight this now, to be honest. 17 of these guys left. Let's bring these guys back in. Thirteen of the guys left, so we need to kill them off. Starting to get them going. Okay. They're gone, they're shattered, but we want to kill them all if we can. Same thing here, so we need to... Let's move back onto the... Point of capture. Let's see if we can hold off. I think we've dealt with all of them on that side. We dealt with the attack on the beach. Um, those guys going that way. Oh, I see. Right now, what's happening over here? What are these guys doing? They're literally sitting there, not doing anything. Okay, fine. Let's speed things up. We'll sit there and recover ourselves. If they're literally going to sit there and not do anything, I'll stop recording and just re-record when actually the battle's over. But it, it looks to me as if they're just going to sit there and I can't afford to go and attack them because I'll probably lose. Um, you can see I don't have many troops left. Um, yeah. So where can we hold them in a bottleneck? Probably. Let's have a look. Depends which way they come. I'm going to keep in the centre so I can then deploy as they move. Still got my general left. This is so weird. There's still 42 minutes left of the battle. So <laughs> So I'm, I'm not going to go and attack them. What I'll do, I'll stop recording and then we'll just wait and see. Um, I don't think there's any more troops to come off of here. I think we're okay. Defeated that, those groups. Defeat the group on the beach. So it is only these guys. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop recording and I'll start recording. I'll go and make myself a cup of tea. Um, and then I'll come back and then we'll see if anything's happened. Okay, so I'll say bye for now, and then we'll start re-recording once um, the battle's actually... Warriors! They will bleed for us. Hello, welcome back. Um, it looks as if the Numidian horsemen uh, would rather kind of get the deck of pack, pack of cards out and have a game of cards, maybe have a beach barbie rather than come and attack me. Um, they just literally sat there for about... 40 minutes. I mean, I obviously I fast forwarded that. I didn't watch it for 40 minutes. Um, see, they still had um, quite a lot of troops left. Why on earth they didn't come and attack us? I honestly don't know. Um, it obviously, it worked out in some way that it was going to lose. Perhaps it wasn't worth it attacking. I honestly don't know. It got into some kind of paradox anyway that it couldn't move forwards. Uh, you can see we've killed quite a few of their troops, and these are all garrison troops that I've used, so I'm not really that bothered, to be honest, even if they come and attack me again. I don't really care. Well, um, in fact, it looks as if they are going to attack me again. Right, I think this time we'll just auto-resolve, because we, we really do not have a chance at all, so we'll just um, auto-resolve, give them a chance to win the thing. Speed things up. Okay, 
so they've, they've captured Lepsis. So we'll go and get that back off them in a moment. I think they had three stacks, we've now weakened that. There's only got um, like two and a half. I find out now they're actually committed to defending a, a port. Um, Lepsis will be able to go and get them, attack them and destroy them. Okay, that's because we don't have all of the territories anymore. Construction complete. Wow, we're building loads of stuff actually. That's good. Got 6,000, fleet destroyed, that's the garrison fleet. Okay, so where's that? Minia men. So I've lost Lepsis. Honestly, we've hardly lost any settlements, I don't think. Almost none, I would have thought. When I look at the stats at the end of the game, we'll have to have a look. But I honestly think this is so unusual for us to lose anything, to be honest. Uh, right, we're moving this guy up to here. Steady as we go. Leaving the ship. This guy can go here. Well, these guys in. I think we could probably say I thought we could upgrade these guys. Oh, well, what the hell? Let's do the general as well. And let's move these guys up. I'm going to move them to attack the Simbri. So we're going to move up to here. That's going to take forever, but we shall do that. Um, I haven't played this for a while, so I'm just going to quickly show you what's going on with the, um, in terms of the sort of diplomatic side of things. Okay, we are ready to do our duty to the tribe, absolutely. Um, right, let's have a look at things diplomatic. I say we haven't played this for a while, so let's look at public order. Okay, so we're finishing off the yeah the Massilii. They've taken that back. We still got um, armies around that can come and attack them. Um, we're repositioning to attack the Simbi, and we're going to swing through northern Europe, down through the, and into the Balkans, and then across into Anatolia and around the, the Black Sea, the north coast of the Black Sea. We should hold fire here. I don't want to attack the Seleucids. They seem as if they've got a lot of territories, actually. Yeah, they seem to be quite a powerful. Yeah, so we shan't do that. We shall, as I said, we will move through here. We move some arms up through here to attack across the centre, and four armies will attack in the north. Um, we'll leave four armies down here. I think I can now do 12 armies, I believe. Uh, diplomatic status. We've got some allies in the Central Europe to hold the position, so we'll have a force of four armies moving this way. Um, we'll have four armies moving up through here, cutting across, and then all the armies will swing south to attack the Cimmeria and these Bilfi and all the other odd sort of barbarian tribes that are around. Okay, so you, you now know the picture. Um, so I think what I want to do. Okay, so that's there's on his way. Uh, we need to capture that port back, don't we? Of Lepsis. Uh, we do have troops around. Let's let's finish off there. Let's finish off these guys first. Can we really not move that f that far? Honestly. Okay. Well, we'll do it in the next turn. Ammonium. There's nothing there. Um, so I think what I'm going to do with these guys. Let's keep them heading north. What can we not... I don't want to attack. I just want to move up to here. Okay, that's what we're going to do. Got those two there, and I think I've got two in northern Italy as well. Let's have a look. 
Yes. Let's get a short. Just let's be so careful with the pathfinding here. Is there nothing else? The Nori. Are they allies? Let's have a look. The Nori. Very friendly. Already trading. I look forward to your wisdom. What I trust ah, that's interesting. They're not interested. We're unreliable, so maybe that's why we've got to let things calm down a bit, I think. So we're going to need to head around through here, I think. The Rieta, I'm sure, are our allies. Yeah. Yeah, they certainly are. Very friendly. I can't remember. Do you well do you come. get military access we'll straight away? Then we will feast until our guts rumble and our backsides ache from overuse. Yeah, whatever. Didn't like the sound of that. Our backsides ache from overuse. That sounded a bit um, homosexual rape kind of thing. Right, so we're gonna have to go around here. That's what we should do. These four. And also these two coming up will join those two. These two that are off the coast here. They move up. We need to come back and use this troop, these troops here to attack. Let's have a look. Right, these need to go into normal stance. So we'll garrison Macromardis. It's really annoying this. These guys are what has he got? Yeah, it's quite annoying. I'm hoping the Helvetii will actually do us a favour. They're at war with the Mac, with the um, Massilii. Really? Can he not move in? Really? Okay. Uh, these guys we need to I'll get all the right guys. These guys we need to move down. Oh, we can't reach, so we're going to have to Perhaps I was a bit premature running these guys back, you know. Uh, let's bring them down to the port. It's a weird bit of pathfinding. Actually, we're going to go. Going to go in here. He's still got an admiral there, so we've got an army here, and an army here. Okay, let's have a quick look around and see what we're doing in terms of. Are we going to lose Thrapsus? No, probably not. Okay. Can't rebuild much else. Nope. Nope, I think we're going to end the turn there and we'll see what... Um, ah, I can still do an edict. That isn't really of much use, to be honest. Let's do one close to where we are. Go do one here. Nope. Can't do one here because the Nori suddenly rushed in and got the territory there. That was so annoying actually. Carolis, who just do one there? Okay, let's end the turn. Oh. I thought I'd issued an edict there. Something really weird there. Let's try here. Now can we end our turn? We can. Okay, Let's see what the Massilii do. They're a bit annoying. We'll have a look and see what they're up to. These are my agents just moving through to get a view of what Lucids have. Still got quite a few agents I can raise. I think about another six. I should do that once we're at war with the Simri. We'll raise them and use them to do damage and to observe where they are. There's no point in raising them then having to move them halfway across the map. The movement is so poor it would take forever and it would just become tedious. So I'll actually raise them in cities that are close to the border.
keep thinking the Symbi are actually going to attack me, to be honest. That would be a first, one of the AI factions attacking me. The AI is so passive in this game, it's... it's wow. I say this is on very hard, very hard. I'd hate to see what it was like on easy. It would just be unbelievable. We have driven too hard a bargain, or haggled over long, it seems. Get on with that. Very good. Uh, something here. Right. Okay. Well, I think we'll fight this in the next um, episode. Again, it's it's mainly the medium cavalry, so we should be able to defeat them. In fact, I'm just going to auto-resolve this. We'll give it another five minutes of the um, episode just to move on and see if I can capture back these um, territories from Massilii. It's weird, he's actually left Lepsis, so I think he can just walk in. in terms of like their, their abilities. Okay, edict issue, edict issue, construction report, straight gained. I don't even know what adventuring is to be honest. <laughs> I've no idea. Bastanai. Oh, they're a big They're a big faction. Okay. Let's continue building up this army. This is our twelfth army. Uh, let's continue with that. Let's continue to move north. A couple of armies here, aren't we? This guy here, we're going to move around as well. So there's two, so we'll do the same with these two here. We move them up. Honor the gods and your ancestors. To travel is to be truly free. They're a happy bunch, aren't they? These Gallic Confederation guys, the Gauls. To travel is to be truly free. They're such happy guys. Okay. So I can see what's happening down here. I think there was the territory here. What are these guys doing? Um, might be worth going and killing these. Oh, we can't reach them. Let's go and kill this settlement. Oh, I lost a general there or something. I don't understand what, what happened there, to be honest. No idea. Okay. So we need to do some upgrading in these lots next turn. This group of territories. What has he got there? It's an admiral, so we're probably going to lose if we actually did that. We'll stay there at the moment. These guys can probably attack Lepsis. Can take it back. If we can reach, I'm not even sure we can reach, can we? No. But we shall do. There's an army there. General there, actually. 
They actually had a lot of units left, didn't they? Oh well, they're providing some interest for us. Um, okay, so we're going to watch this guy. They're probably going to attack here, which has like a really terrible garrison. <laughs> Seven guys. They'll have trouble holding off these guys. Well, we'll just come back. We'll come back and take it. Can't move out of here at the moment. We'll move back and take that. It's just really a, a, dis, a distraction, to be honest. Uh, we'll see what the Watchers of the Waves do. I didn't realise I had so many units actually in their, in their um, army. I mean, I would have thought... Can we attack this? I don't think we can, can we? It's quite annoying. I have to do that next turn. Right, okay, I think we're going to end the episode there. You can see what's happening, basically. We, we do have a slight problem with these Massilite, but it's only an annoyance, to be honest. Um, we've got one, two, three armies to take, take them out. Um, Saying that, we'll have four armies once this army's built up. The one over here that's recruiting, that'll come down and go into the Seleucids area. Um, just to recap the strategy, we've got two armies there coming through. Four armies, they're going to attack through here. I'm saying that, we're not going to be able to get through the Nori area, are we? Perhaps we should land in the Bruchii area. Attack the FSCI first. Yeah, we'll maybe look at that. Worst case is we have to come through here. Um, I'm not adverse to attacking the Nori. Um, we may well do that anyway. That will give us a chance to take out Syracuse as well. So we've got a slight problem down here. There's a few more units we need to take out. One, two, three, four, five um, groups of troops. Got this army here moving up. That will give us four to attack here. There'll be four to push through the centre. This army here will come down and join in an attack. Uh, sorry, and defend along here, the coast um, along here, and in Greece. Uh, sorry, in Magna Gratia. Um, some problems, not much. Public order plus five, plus eleven. A lot of this is historical. Minus thirty. Uh, there's a lot of hassle going on in this. Libya at the moment. Once that's all sorted out, I'm sure things will be fine. Public order wise, we we'll won't be able to do an edict, but we'll have armies in this territory. Um, we should be able to put another edict into Africa, which will calm things down. Hey, okay, thanks for your time. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. At least we fought a battle this time, although the yeah, AI did seem to sit around for 40 minutes and not do anything and then got beaten just by me sitting there. Um, okay. I'll be speaking to you soon. Bye for now.